We begin this half hour with a fire at a yacht club on Gross Eel. You can see the raging flames caught on video, burning several boats and even causing some of them to sink. Thankfully, no one was hurt. Chopper 7 did fly over that area earlier this morning. 7 Action News reporter Brett Cast has the latest on the investigation. That early morning fire left a number of boats damaged. Now investigators are trying to find out the cause. Flames and smoke billowing from the harbor at Ford Yacht Club early this morning. Five boats catching fire, two of them sinking to the bottom. It was large. Uh, flames were probably 10 to 15 feet in the air. Police and firefighters rushed to the scene, moving other boats out of the way with the narrow dock causing a challenge. You have a small area to work with. I know the fire department used their aerial truck to help extinguish the fire, but it posed some difficulties uh, this morning for us. Some people sleeping on nearby boats, but the boats that caught fire were empty. And by mid-October, the marina was emptying out too. Actually, we're very fortunate here that uh, many of the boats were out of the harbor at the time. So it, this could have been significantly worse had we had, had this happened three weeks ago. In the race to put the fire out, one firefighter was pushed into the water and had to be rescued by other firefighters. He had his turnout gear on, and, uh, but they were able to get him out uh, safely. While it's still too early to say what caused the fire, investigators say there's nothing that indicates foul play. At this point, it doesn't look like it was intentional. It doesn't look like there was anybody in the club at the time of the fire. Now, the owners of all those boats that caught fire have been notified. The two boats that sunk to the bottom are in the process of being towed out. Reporting in Gross Seal, I'm Brett Cast, 7 Action News. All right, Brett, thank you.